Hey, yo, what's up, y'all? It's your boy Jay West, man. You know, chilling right now, bringing you another episode of West TV. I'm out here in an undisclosed location, just hanging out, chilling on vacation. Because, you know, hard work deserves a break. Uh, can't be going insane. <laughs> um, I know that I haven't been releasing a lot of West TV episodes. You know, that's, that's understandable. So soon, you know, I'm working hard and I'm, I'm trying to put my music out to more and more people. Speaking of which, you know what I'm saying? And my project got dropped from last November, Back to the Basics, the Music EP, you know what I'm saying? And I got my new joint, Back to Basics, POW, or the Power Words. Both of these joints are hosted by DJ Ames over in the UK. You know, y'all can download on a bunch of sites. MixtapePass.com, Piff, uh, DJ Ames personal website. Or if you see me in the streets, you know, holla at me. I have all copies all day, you know. The real thing I wanted to get off my chest was something that uh, a fellow artist of mine from Massachusetts said, uh, Touchable is the Beast. Um, the short version of it is, is if you're artist A and you're working hard and you're grinding and you're putting time, effort, money, and dedication to your music, that's what's up. But if you're gonna sit there and hate on artist B, you know, that's that makes no sense. It's kind of productive, it's stupid. And um, I tend to agree with him a lot on that. I mean, if y'all think about it from the city of Boston, New York is like three and a half, four hours away. You know, it's the entertainment capital of the world. We're still looked at as uh, minor leagues or small players. And I don't think that's fair. I think that, um, you know, if you got artists out there that's talented and you like what they're doing, you, know, you don't necessarily have to buy every project they come out with, everything they come out with. I mean, you can retweet uh, a YouTube link or that piff link or whatever. You can share it on your Facebook. You can, you know, Letting them know about the artist through word of mouth. Um, you can hit them up with a hard copy if they need a free hard copy, you know what I'm saying? Or direct them to a website where you can buy the music. You know, anything like that because um, I'm, I'm, I'm a believer in, like, you know, you gotta you tell 100 people about a show, you know? And then each of those people tell two of their friends. You know, that's 300 people. If a third of those people come through, you know what I'm saying? If we're being realistic, if a third of those people come through to that venue, you know, that's a decent turnout. It's like a little small local venue or something like that. So I think, you know, showing that you like an artist or you got love for artists, you respect this craft, it isn't a sign of weakness. It's just, you know, you salute people. Real recognized, real. And I think that's what people need to do more. You know, I, I notice a lot of artists in Massachusetts that got some skill and we need to get more acknowledgement, you know? You got people like Huba Christ, Chris Mills, Touchable Miz the Beast, Guillotine, A Ladge, Notoriety, the famous Nobodies, fan of Lex Get It On, you know, just show love and support, man. That's, that's, that's what it's about, you know what I'm saying? Like, me personally, if I like an artist, you know what I'm saying, I'm gonna check their music out, um, you know, I'll retweet it, I'll share it, something like that. It's nothing to me, man, because, you know, it won't cost nothing to just sit there and click and you know, share it with the world. Um, if I don't like an artist, you know, I'm not gonna, you know, sit there and sort of support their music, but I'm not gonna sit there and hate on it, you know, I'm just being realistic, like, you don't have to like everything that comes out, but at the same time, you don't have to sit there and throw dirt on the next man. You know, you just have to keep doing what you're doing and you want to surpass them. They're going to be in your rear view in no time. So might even double up on them before you know it. So, I think, I think the hating you know, needs to be minimized. Because be real, there's hate everywhere. But if the hate's minimized, you know, you start showing more and you know, respect. You know, people get a lot further than people do, you know? Even though people say it's cutthroat, it's like, yo, you can only be cutthroat for so long, you know? Then real people gonna shine through. They, they last in this business, you know? Until next time, people, holler at your boy. I'm 
here, man. Don't forget, like I said, Back to Basics EP, Back to Basics POW EP. It's out there. Go download it. Go play it. Go stream it. Go share it. You know, go to my YouTube page, Twitter page, or my Facebook page, or my Reverb Nation page. Just you know, keep showing love. And uh, all the artists that I named before, I want y'all to know. Go check them out. Um, I'll probably shout them out anyways about this video and whatnot. And the links to their pages. Now show them love and let them know what it is, alright? One.